Hello, it's Vinny here. Today, um, this video, I'd like to cover the use of trading view, especially on how you can insert boxes to frame up your price movement. All right, so uh, how to do that? It's with the indicator available in trading view, and that indicator is called multi-time period charts okay so that's a built-in indicator multi-time period charts so what you have to do is just click on it and then um, it will appear on your indicator list here I have the multi-time period charts as available on my indicator list I just have to activate that okay and then you're gonna see this indicator fascinating indicator that plots the auto boxes auto boxes is one of the very very useful tools that we are using for the alien wash strategy all right and then uh, it box the prices up into meaningful time frame so for example what are the time frame that the, it boxed up okay so let's take a look at time frame available you can choose the auto time frame so for example if you choose the auto time frame at the um, week chart you would plotting a month so it will always be plotting one time frame higher all right uh, for those who are on a free plan right then you won't have the uh, other uh, time frame available right you won't have the quarterly which is the three months or you won't have the 12 months right now uh, if you don't want it to be auto time frame you can define that you want to plot only a monthly chart so you can choose the monthly chart for the calculation, I would use the high-low range because we are interested in what's the high-low range of a particular month, right? But you can definitely choose to go for a true range or hanky Aishi range, okay? Then here, you can define the color of the bodies, right? If you want something that's um, neutral, for example, you can just use the yellow, right? So that will change the color into yellow. Right, so but just keep it to what I have here, which is blue for now. Okay, and then uh, under the style, you can just define whether you want it to be boxes or you don't want it to be boxes. And visibility means that uh, whether where you want to see the boxes. Okay, so for example, I want to see that only in the higher time frame and not anything that's lower than the uh, day. Okay, so that's it. Now I have the uh, boxes all plotted out. You can see, for example, if I go to the month, you know, it doesn't appear nice. And because then I've defined these as the month. Okay, but if I go to the day, okay, what this tells me is clearly is the movement uh, month to month. All right, so I can see, for example, this stock here, Tencent, right, has moved down in the month of July and has been staying a little bit flat. Okay, with each of the low here, it's been probably around 420. Okay, and probably a cluster of resistance coming in here based on this historical boxes low. All right, and that, that's uh, about 520 as the resistance. The order boxes are definitely very, very um, useful. In fact, that for my own trading, which is trading into the indexes, the commodities, and the forex. I've also boxed my up and auto box is something that I've designed and and I've incorporated that heavily in all my trading system. Give these boxes a try, I'm sure you loved it.